Um, that's pretty, that's probably a record for my ADC videos. Uh, I remember back when I started, I was at like 25 minutes or something. People were bitching. Hey guys, what's going on? It is time for another EDC update or everyday carry update. And this one is for the month of April 2016. And it is all the most carried gear for that month for me um, that I carry on an everyday basis. I'm going to briefly speak about each item and then I'm going to also put a link down in the description box uh, for most of the items. Alright, well let's get on into it. Each item I'm going to, I have on my person literally as I carry it. And I'm going to take each item out and tell you where I carry it. So first item, I'm take it off, is my watch. It is a Casio G-Shock uh, GD100. Not solar, not a kinetic, not anything like that. Just a pretty badass watch. Really rugged, and it keeps time. And the main thing I use it for is the date, actually. Awesome watch. That is on my wrist. I don't know where else you would keep a watch. Uh, left front pocket flashlight this is the this was given to me I did a past video if you want I'll put the link for that video down below uh, lumen top ED11 and it is 550 lumens and I'm really digging it tiny little slim it's got a deep um, reflector there so it's a good thrower got different modes Loosen the head a little bit. You, that's your secondary modes, your strobe, SOS, all that. Bad to the ass. I just sounded like Fat Man there. I, I did not even mean that. Multi-tool. This is in my left front pocket as well. This is clipped. This is down in it. And it is the Leatherman Rebar. Love this multi-tool. Um, it is. It hits that perfect sweet spot for me. The juice was a tiny bit too light duty. And this is a little more heavy duty. Um, it is just, I mean, this is a medium duty, but it's just perfect for my application, and I actually do use almost everything on this, I would say on a weekly basis. Um, also down in my left pocket, I keep my vape juice in this unicorn bottle. Um, yeah, that's that. At least I don't smoke anymore, right? Alright, front right pocket, clipped to my pocket is my folder that I keep. Um, this is the Gonzo... What is the model? G739BK. It doesn't say BK there, but I know that is the model. And this thing is sweet. It's a Griptilian. It's a Benchmade Griptilian tribute. <laughs> I had someone comment, you should use the word tribute on my video for this, because at first I put clone, and it started some giant friggin' argument, and people, I don't know, not really argument, but really good discussions on what Gonzo's doing and you know how they're proud of their knives uh, so that's why they put their name so big and bold you know right there on the blade they're not trying to clone knives uh, they're just taking a lot of the best features and then adding their own little spin to it um, <clears throat> but basically it has the stylings of a grit, grip, uh, Benchmade Griptilian so that's front right pocket also down in my front right pocket I keep my phone um, if you are up on my videos and saw one of my most recent ones, it was me putting the liquid armor on this as a phone screen protector instead of the stupid plastic ones that peel and stuff. Um, I'll put a link for that video down below. But freaking rocks, awesome, it is the Galaxy S7 Edge. I didn't even say the name for it. What am I doing? It is a Galaxy S7 Edge in black and... Uh, yeah, got the Otterbox Symmetry case on it. The case is pretty sweet. It is that real hard plastic, and then it's got kind of like a rubber liner, but the rubber liner isn't separate. Let me pop it off here. Yeah, the freaking phone is sexy AF, guys. It is freaking awesome. Um, fingerprint. It's got the cool edge feature. You can customize that, like, to no end. But, there's that. Here's the case. It's got a really light, thin rubber type material on the whole inside. And then it transitions to this harder plastic on the outside. So, I mean, I trust it. 
I feel very comfortable and confident in that case. I had a Tech 21 case and I didn't feel as comfortable or confident. All right, back left wallet. Same old wallet. Got a picture of my daughter. That was when she was first born. She's obviously much bigger now. Cash cards. Behind here I keep my ID and my concealed carry permit. Nothing, nothing very interesting on that. All right, that is it for my back left. My back right pocket, I keep my vape. It is a, uh, what is it, Os Asmodus Minkin 4, I think, I believe. And it is a sweet little, you know, portable, very compact. Takes two 18650 batteries and holds a good charge. Lasts for over a day. I run it at 40 watts. And then I got the Aspire Cleto tank up top, sporting. Um, winding down here. I am. I got a couple extras. My sunglasses. I go nowhere without. These are the Oakley crankshafts, and I like them because I tried on a bunch at the store. Sunglass Hut, and these were the best. You know, they looked the best on me. I like this style. The kind of squared squared off. I don't like the super sporty fishing, you know, red lens, blue lens. Not into that craziness. Um, keys. I'm running the free swag that I got from Battlebox, which includes this uh, lanyard type key fob thing, and then also this AR-15 hammer bottle opener by Martin American Designs. Wow, I'm surprised I freaking remembered that. Um, on it, I keep, on this thing, I keep uh, a little Magnolite Mini 1 AAA. I like that because AAAs are a lot easier to find and get than uh, those stupid little button cells for a lot of the keychain lights. And, you know, it hangs as low as my key does, so it doesn't really bulk it up. Got my house key, got the key to my safe. I took my 69 Ford Bronco, I took those off. Those are a separate key fob now. Keys in my truck. Got the Leatherman style uh, CS. These are the scissors. Is it CS? Yeah, style CS. Uh, it's got the tweezers. I'll put a link. Got a little sand disc, flash drive, and then the bottle opener again. I am about to enter week three of going to the gym Monday through Friday. Every day for about an hour. Some days half hour 45 minutes but I try to hit that hour mark so these are my gym keys I want them very small minimalist um, and I have my spare on there for my truck got a tiny little carabiner that's just to hang it on my key thing got my house key my planet fitness uh, membership black card and then this is a cool little night eyes I forget what it's called but it holds your headphones and that is awesome got a lot of compliments on that uh, from the people at the desk and stuff but that's pretty cool and then I guess last but not least I gotta actually undo it <laughs> sounds like I'm getting naked is my firearm this is the urban carry holsters holster and it is breaking in very nicely I absolutely love it it's getting more and more comfortable basically every week every week I feel it's more flexible and comfortable and just kind of goes with you a little bit more um, but in it I carry and this is a below the waistline tuckable you know that's all you see I did a whole video on it uh, might as well throw that link down below too but um yeah that is that you can keep a card back here American handmade um, with American leather and then the firearm I keep is the Glock 43 in 9mm and I love it it's comparable to the Luger LC9, the m and Shield a lot of other subcompact 9mm single stacks and I just like it I don't really have crazy money to spend so I bought this and I'm sticking to it until you know I have a little cushion money and I can actually get you know a shield or something else to kind of test out mess around with um, and then I keep my P11 by kel -Tec. I keep that in my truck as my truck gun. Alright guys, right about 10 minutes. 
Um, that's pretty, that's probably a record for my ADC videos. Uh, I remember back when I started, I was at like 25 minutes or something. People were bitching. But that is it. This is my EDC uh, reference links for further information. Stay safe and have a good one.